Hello friends. In this video, I shows you how to save a burned sky and turn it into a sunset. That's a lot of photos you see I edited. So it's always I taking a picture and the sky is dark. However, in this photo, I took the sky it was bright. Let us see how powerful the fine art secret tool is in restoring my sky. Note that with these ways of capturing the burning sky, you need a good camera. Only to be able to exploit its strengths. And if your camera is too old, you should not shoot to save it. Then you can only pair clouds. Then I will open this photo. You will use the feature to subtract highlight. Do you see the highlight minus? I'll start off. Then I see that part of the sky it recovered. Continue. Except for the next highlight. Then I'll see the part of the sky it turns around. It's gray. Because from the burning part, it's always going to be gray like this. That's why I always shoot in low light so that the sky is beautiful. Then I will start restoring the highlights that are dark. Here I will reset this brush again. 100%, I will leave about 80% or 70%. Then I left it at 70%, and I started scanning in the parts that I didn't want it to be dark. The skin part, you pay attention to scan carefully. This is the important part. Then I have to work carefully and spend more time. And you see the pictures that I guided you. Shooting at night is very easy to adjust. No zoning, no scanning like this very time consuming to restore the heavens of this photo then i just need to carefully scan the face and these parts can be enlarged this part is not very important i scan in this part is too bright i wants to reduce it now i changes the mask Change to white mask and SAM reduced to 50%, now I scans here. Then I will see that this chiffon is dark, 50% is a bit high. Just let it be 30. Then I will reduce this part it down. Before, after. If this part has not been scanned yet, I will scan it. Then there is the squeeze part, liquify, this part is up to your preferences. You can liquify the subject. After I save the details of the sky. So now I will put the color in the clouds. At this point, I will choose my sunset sky. Press J, select the selection. Okay. So in this photo too, I will start with removing the yellow cast on the subject. I will scan here. There is only a little, but not much. Sweeping apart affects the grass as well. Then I saw before, after. Okay, next I will do the sky color. Press J, drag up. In this sky color, I want more of it pink, so I pulls in a little more pink. Click OK. Then I see that now with this step, I see my sky has color. Right? It's already pink. Next is still my sunset color correction process, I will add sunset. I will add one, do you think it's enough? Well, I think it's okay, then I will continue to reduce this yellow influence on the subject at this time.
I'd lightly scan the subject. This part if I want to affect less, I scan less. Here I see before, after. Then I added another art to darken the photo. Because I thinks this picture is beautiful, but not enough art. Then if you want art, click on this art. That you see? Now the color it is very impressive. This color, I will not change, but I will give whiter skin. By being skin, white skin. Have you seen the white skin yet? If this photo is too white, it's not beautiful. I will leave it less. I will have a before, after picture. Then now I will merge the layer and I liquefy. Squeeze people. Then I'll squeeze a little bit. This chiffon, I can also let it glide a little bit. It also hovered. Notice the stairs. Okay. Now comes the part where I will block this image. Then I can add some borders here. I will merge the layer again. Before, after. Then now I will create a new layer. I will dodge. Then I can darken this part of the ground. Because it's getting a little too bright. I can also darken these leaves. You see before, after. Then after I block. My photo has better depth and emphasis. Then you see with just a few simple steps, I have recovered the photo from the burning sky. Always on fire. Restoring and adjusting to a very beautiful color without grafting. When I set it up, of course. It will have some flaws when I drag it to the sky. However, it will be much more beautiful with the compound rattan. Because when I combine clouds, the image will not be real. Borders, especially when there are leaves here. If you graph clouds, these places will be fake. So the reason why you can see is that Sam barely grafted clouds. And Sam is the post-production of the photo to keep its original cloud and add color to make it more impressive. By Fine Art Secret. Okay, I review the before. After. Depending on each person's photo editing taste, this photo is not the final one. For many people who like the image to be darker, you can adjust it more, for example, I choose focus light. Then I press J. Then it will select the selection, I will widen it. Then now you can choose the mine directly. I drag the dark down further, then you can see the picture of your photo, you can darken as much as you like. Take this level for example. Okay, you see, the picture is very dark. I can lower the opacity. Depends on your wishes about the photo. Then with such a dark photo, I will continue to block the next photo. I hit blocks by the way I choose as bounce. I made the light parts brighter, because it's dark now. I have to choose dodge.
Then you can also hit this bush a little bit, to make it more impressive. I can choose brush, contrast or detail. When it came back, I did not add detail to the photo, then you can add detail. That, I can delete the detail. Reset the brush, choose 50% opacity, then I will erase into the skin. Because I only want 50% skin. Then you see that a photo, its color correction is not limited. Depends on your preferences. Before, after. Then if you want the clouds, it's even more impressive. Then you can choose brush, vibrance. Then you can add vibrance to the cloud. Highlight this cloud, you see? Then I can choose more vibrances. That's why when you take a picture file with higher quality, the more you can edit. Because retouching has no limit, it's limited to image files only. If my image file is more beautiful, the more I can retouch, the more beautiful it will be, you see. Clouds themselves can also increase, before, after. Depending on each person's photo taste, you can have a lot of levels to adjust. In addition, you can also add smoke to this photo. I choose a certain smoke, depending on my preference. Make it more magical. Then here I delete the border. Before, after. You see there are many ways for me to add effects with fine art secret, everything is very easy and fast. 